frail, bones protruding and clinging to life. Children are on the brink of death. They're too weak to drink. Gazan authorities say at least 27 children have died from malnutrition and dehydration. The medical situation is getting worse day by day. We fear a major health catastrophe. Three or four children die at Kamal Radwan Hospital every day. Two-year-old Wating is so weak she can't move her body. Her mother has gone from hospital to hospital looking for help. Her daughter now weighs as little as a baby half her age. She was 14 kilos and now she weighs 7.5 kilos. My daughter is leaving me little by little. My daughter used to walk, smile, talk, jump, and now she is like paralyzed. All across Gaza, children are perishing without food and water. The United Nations says the deaths are entirely preventable. It's more aid that's needed. 11-month-old Fuad has lost nearly half of his weight, now just five kilograms. The video was shot when he was five months old. I don't know what to say anymore. The UN predicts child wasting, which is life-threatening malnutrition, will soon affect at least 10,000 children in Gaza. Parents here have little hope. Our situation is worse than the war and the shelling of the Israelis. As people, we are almost dead. We are dead. And while doctors do what they can to save the young lives, children continue to die. Alison Horn, ABC News, Jerusalem.